Hello, it's Miss Julie from Miss Julie's Virtual Preschool and Crafts. I'm here to do a fun story for you today. But before we get started, hit that subscribe button below so you can see when I put out new videos I've created just for you. We are going to be talking about going back to school soon. Maybe some of you are starting school for the first time, or maybe you're returning to another grade or a new school building. But I've chosen some back to school books to share with you, and I hope you enjoy them. The book is King of Kindergarten. So if you're going to school for kindergarten for the first time, this may be a good book for you to read at home or check out from your library. Nice picture. The morning sun blares through your window with a million brass trumpets. It sits and shines behind your head like a crown. Mommy says that today you are going to be the king of kindergarten. You'll use a golden brush to clean your royal chiclets and you'll wash your own face with a cloth bearing the family crest. You'll dress yourself neatly in hand-picked garments from the far off villages of Oshkosh Bigosh. You'll be ready to rain. My baby is heading to school, mommy will say during breakfast, but you're not a baby. The baby wolf on a tower of pancakes the way you can? I don't think so. You're growing up so fast, Daddy will say, and you'll be right. I can't say the same size forever, can I? One day I'll be taller than you, Daddy, and you'll be the, my little man. Daddy will laugh, but you won't be joking. And a big yellow carriage will deliver you to your grand fortress. As you walk up the towering doors, you'll remember mommy saying, hold your head high and greet everyone with a brilliant, beaming, majestic smile. For you are the king of kindergarten. Your teacher will welcome you with a warm smile and a friendly good morning. She'll be delighted how you recite your name with pride. When you head to your royal seat, the kids at your round table will wave and say hi like they've been waiting on you all summer. So you smile back and return the wave and give them a cheerful hi, everybody. The truth is you couldn't wait to meet your kindergarten kingdom either. Your teacher will go over the class rules. You will all discuss important matters such as shapes, the alphabet, and the never-ending mystery of numbers. So I'll even read a book about trucks and trains and tractors. Ooh, sounds like a lot, but the king of kindergarten, piece of cake. You will show your bravery at recess when you go up one of those classmates and say, Marie, would you want to play with me? Not only will she say yes, but she'll lead the way, helping you save the kingdom by battling the fire-breathing dragon. In the cafeteria, the boy sitting next to you will be missing dessert. You have packed your favorite chocolate pudding with an extra cup just in case. So you will say to him, want a pudding, Howie? He will say thanks, and you won't mind at all because... Would be cooler than sharing with new friends. After a royal rest, you'll still rise to sing and dance and pop to the rhythmic beat.
The day will one be you never forget. And at the end of it, your teacher will wish you all a magnificent evening and bid you a farewell till dawn. On your way back home, I'll think of all the things you can't wait to tell your parents. I made a bunch of new friends. My teacher is nice. Recess is the best thing ever. And tomorrow, it'll begin again. Another day is the charming and wonderful and the kind king of kindergarten. That was a fun book. And I hope it gave you some ideas about to start your school year and how you can do the best you can in kindergarten or any grade that you be, be entering this year. All right, come back next time for another story or craft from Miss Julie's Virtual Preschool and Crafts. Thank you.